Well, see you guys in two months. Oh, I need water. Has it been two months already? Okay, let me just grab all of my armor and stuff. Okay, Jesus, why is the sun so bright? Okay, water. I keep water in my kitchen. And that's like over here. Okay. Okay, nothing really looks that different. Water, water, water. Oh my god. God, water's never tasted so good. Also, why did... Um, okay, I guess that one of the chickens laid their eggs in there. Oh, that's different. Okay, well, I gotta clean that up at some point. Oh, and that's also... Oh, scaling. You have definitely seen better days, dude. Holy, you are very overgrown. Branded, are you home? I'm back. There's just nobody here? Um, okay, that's kind of weird. Oh, that is... Wow. Okay, this is cooled down, I guess. And then the trophy. Oh, I guess that the handle broke off. Hello, Fennec. Hello, horses. Gary. Wait, that's your name, right? Gary? Hello, Jerk and Black Knight. Hello, Crystal and Goldie. Now, where is my favorite person in the house? Mr. Stern. Hello, Heatherworth. I'm back. Uh, have you seen Stern anywhere? Uh, oh, he's in his room? Okay. Why did I even ask him? He hasn't left his room in, like, months. Stern, are you in here? I kind of doubt it. Yeah, you and your family never go in here. He's probably upstairs. Hello, Stern. I'm back, man. Oh, look at my room. It hasn't changed literally at all. I never look out this balcony, but honestly, this is a really good view. Like, you could see my cabin and stuff. I mean, there is like a giant tower right here, so that's pretty annoying. And poultry man's axe. Oh, honestly, life could not get any more beautiful. Um, okay, I'm about to head to Crime Corp right now. Everybody at Crime Corp should be. Oh, wait, I totally forgot about Pepper. Hello, Pepper. I'm back. Anyways, back to what I was saying. Hopefully, everybody at. David? David? What are you doing? Hey, Dave. Ah! <sighs> I saw him over and over again for the past two months, watching every single bad thing he has ever done to me. I thought it would end when I came back, but it hasn't. Over the years, he has become more and more powerful. He's in my head because he knows that I'm weak. I thought maybe there was the slightest chance that he could have died. But what I've learned is he doesn't die, just like me. Anyways, thank you for listening, like always. <sighs> okay, that was a very, very long day. I actually didn't tell David or anybody else at Crime Corp, for that matter, um, about anything that has happened in the past two months. It's just really not their problem. Plus, I don't want anybody worrying about me. So, I'll see you guys in the morning. He's coming for you, and you know it. He's not dead. He doesn't die. They didn't kill him. Wake up! <sighs> <sighs> okay, you know, that was not one of the nicest sleeps that I've ever had. I don't know, all I heard was cows the whole entire night. But I just couldn't sleep in my house after what happened last night. Okay, well let's head... Why is there a bunch of golden pressure plates? And they're leading down into my ravine. Okay. Okay, I'm not seeing anybody or anything down inside of the tunnel. Oh, come on, man. I know you're not real. You're just in my head. Okay. Uh, you're definitely real. Well, I'm gonna get... Huh. Okay. Poacher Man's not an idiot, so I'm assuming that there's TNT under here. Okay, he dropped me a book. I'm gonna need that axe back, Sunset, tonight, your house. Give the axe back or I'll hurt you. Uh, okay, well, I don't have anything on me, so... Yup, why not? Ooh, gotta run. Okay. Yup, Poacher Man's definitely not an idiot. He should be here any second now if he's a man of his word. <sighs> it's about time you showed up. You want this axe? Then come and get it. Ah! Okay. Yep, that definitely hurt. No, I think that creeper bro got shot. No! I have his body on me! Ah! 
Okay, hey, let's talk. I prepared a dinner for us. Are you hungry? Okay, where's the replica? I know that I have a replica X somewhere around here. Is it in my chest? Ooh, oh, wait, I actually do need my disguise mask. Come on, the replica should be some... Oh, okay, there, I found it. Now, just in case he was planning something, I am going through the vents. Poultry man, I'm coming! Hello, poultry man. Take a seat. Make yourself at home. This night is far from over yet. In my hand is your axe. Masked man with an axe. Stupid looking, isn't it? Put your gun in the chest in front of you. Look at you. No power. No weapons. You are nothing now. What? What? What is this? When I said I'd hurt you, I didn't mean physically. How's the child? Oh, no. No, 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 no. Where is he? Where is he? Come on. Please, no. He can't be dead. No. No, oh, Stern. I'm so... Sorry, okay, no. I need to go back to the Grand Hall right now. There's no way that this poacher man- TAKE OFF YOUR MASK! You're a villager. <sighs> okay, what is this? Another book, of course, it's another- If I didn't do what he said, he would have killed me. You let an innocent kid die so you wouldn't be killed. What else you got on you? Okay, you have some emeralds. Oh, I'm so sorry, the child. The mask, fireworks. You already put your gun inside of here, and a picture. Is this your family? Huh. Are they still alive? No. Okay. And that's why you want to live. For them, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay, well, follow me. I want to show you a place you could stay. Okay, so here we are. Crime Corp. So Poacherman said he wouldn't kill you if you distracted me. But nobody said I wouldn't kill you. So this is what you're gonna do. You're gonna take this book and write the chords of his new base. Cause I'm not stupid. He obviously isn't living at his old place anymore. Okay, perfect. So here's my plan. I'm gonna use the mask you gave me. Oh, and your clothes, but you can give me those in a second. Anyways, I'm gonna use your mask and your clothes to just walk straight into his base. Then when he's least expecting it, I'm gonna chop his head off. Oh yeah, and how could I be so rude? I need to give you something in return, of course. So congratulations, buddy. You're gonna see your family again. <sighs> I'm sorry. <sighs> okay. Welp, who's ready for a triple funeral? Today, we need to bury Creeper Bro, the child, and the poultry villager. The reason why I'm burying the villager is because we honor our dead, no matter how bad they were. So rest in peace, poultry villager, and I hope that you and your family are off somewhere in a happy place together. Creeper bro, you were the first one to die today, and you were caught in the crossfire, so I'm sorry for that, and rest in peace, buddy. And now, the child, son of Stern and Zoe. He was a good kid, just like his father, but poultry man took him away from us. So rest in peace, little man, knowing that I will get revenge for you. Oh, <sighs> what a day. Hello, Stern. <sighs> okay, well, the villager did write down the chords, so I guess tomorrow morning I'll take this mask and his clothes and I'll go kill Poultry Man. Okay, well, I need some rest. I'll see you guys all in the morning. Oh, I cannot sleep. I need something to drink. I have had a horrible day. Okay, let's see. Do I have any rum left? Where do I keep the rum again? Now, let's see. Where's the rum? I have soup, but I don't have any rum. Oh, okay. Here we go. I need some of the... What? No, 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 no. Start. No, it's Zoe. She burned herself alive. Oh, no. I gotta tell Stern. Hey, Stern. Um... She's gone. I am so sorry. I promise I will kill that bad man for what he's done to you. To us. Let me tell you something, Stern. This isn't a fairy tale. Good people will always die first. And bad people, they will die last. Can you just talk to me? But you, you will always live. Because living through it is worse than any death or pain that comes. I know that you didn't know Henry, but he was just like you. When I look at you... I see him. So stay safe, my friend. This started with you and me, so it's gonna end with you and me.